The total solar eclipse is set to capture the public's imagination on Monday, taking a path of totality from Texas up to Maine. But where can people from the Black Hills go to view the spectacle exactly? Our Brian Savage joins us in the studio with the details. The Rapid City Public Library will be holding a solar eclipse viewing party from 11 a.m. through 2 p.m. on Monday. Attendees and astronomy lovers will have the opportunity to watch the eclipse anywhere outside on library grounds. They are free to witness the unique occurrence from their cars standing up or on the grass. Viewing glasses will be free of charge as people can get them at tables in the lobbies. The events coordinator, Ali Quinn, says the library will include a few features set upside. We will also have our sunoculars outside and available for use. Our sunoculars are essentially binoculars that have the filter in them so that you can view safely the solar eclipse. And in addition to that, we'll have our solar telescope set up out there as well, which also has that safe viewing filter. So the library still has over a couple hundred glasses left to be handed out for the viewing party. So Brian, how can people tell the difference between real glasses and fake glasses? Ali Quinn says what you want to look for when inspecting your glasses is the ISO number. If that's missing, then it is fake. Do not use those glasses. If you're viewing the eclipse with counterfeit glasses, it can cause severe eye issues such as temporary or long term blindness. Where can people buy the real glasses in case the library runs out? The American Astronomical Society encourages people to buy from retailers on their approved list, including Walmart, Lowe's, and the Home Depot, while supplies last. All right, thank you very much, Brian.